uh, like Mass Effect 3. We are on Tess here with Lyra and her god, Javik. And we're gonna go into the temple with the main story. Real quick. Well, continue the main story. Oh god. Uh, is anyone there? Something is wrong. Your scientist should be here. Take a look around. Maybe one of these artifacts is what we're looking for. I know where the scientists are. I'm guessing these are the scientists. Executed. Yep. Yeah. Their throats. What happened to them? They've been slit. The Reapers didn't do this. We're going to have to figure this out on our own. Who's that supposed to be? The goddess Athame herself. It's a relic of the old faith. Then why does Athame speak Prothean? What do you mean? There is something here. I can sense it. In this temple? I admit it is strange this place has been so well preserved. Though Athame does have great historical significance, we once believed our gods were separate from the world, looking down on us. But now, a sorry thinking is our cosmic hope. There is a universal energy. Ah! There's a Prothean beacon here. What? You're sure? It's not something you forget. But why hide it? The answer is obvious. Power and influence. Your people are holding the knowledge of my race for their own gain. That can't be. I can't believe my people would keep this a secret. A beacon like this could explain why Asari are so advanced. This temple is thousands of years old. Time enough to make serious progress. That doesn't make it true. Even a small amount of data would give your species an edge. Or are you insulted that your government didn't involve you? <laughs> the Mars ruins are where humanity got Mass Effect technology. And we learned of it from the ruins of the Inusanum, the race that came before us. It was our secret for centuries. Well, if it is true, the Asari should have shared this knowledge. We might not have been in this mess if they had. You don't know that, Shepard. We don't know what's going on here. I know we don't have much time to find out. The few records I can access talk about tapping into Prothean data streams, reconstructing matrices, none of which I see here. I do. The activation process has begun. By the goddess. Literally. Look around. There must be more of these connections. Incredible. The beacon seems to think you're Prothean, Shepard. It must be the cipher you got back on Pharos years ago. Or it could be the Prothean standing next to you. <laughs> oh, there it is. I was waiting for that. Yo, there. There have to be more connections nearby. Could you open that for us, Javik, please? You can see it already. There is nothing useful here. The end of the war is near. Find what we need, finish the crucible, and vengeance is complete. No, you find it. You I know what to do. This whole temple is a front. Best place to hide a secret is out in the open. They've been extracting data from it for centuries. I never knew. Let's hope it doesn't take us as long. The look, the statue of Cherry. It's gaining power. Good, good. It seems oh. each connection provides more power to the beacon. Asari are observant. Was that sarcasm? And easily confused. <laughs> oh, Javik's the best. This doesn't appear to be a connection. We should keep searching. There, another one. It's still not complete. This one? Doesn't look like a connection. <clears throat> The activation is complete. We can access the beacon now. You think to build that statue up every time? If that breaks down. Hey, it's piece five, piece seven. We can access the beacon now. I know. 
I know I'm gonna save beforehand. Good. Let's go. Okay. We need to hurry. This place isn't going to. Last very long. Obtaining chronological marker. Hold. Time scale established. Post Prothean cycle confirmed. One of our computers. Reaper presence detected. This galactic cycle has already reached its extinction terminus. Systems shutting down. Hold on. We need answers. To what question? The catalyst. We need to know what it is to finish the crucible. A memory of one of my people. I am called Vendetta, an advanced virtual construct of Patrick Van, overseer of the project you refer to as Crucible. He died fighting the Reapers in the Battle of Tranvia 9. Your remaining time is also at an end. We're all Protheans so grim. What happened to the Crucible in your time? Why didn't the Protheans deploy it? We were sabotaged from within. A splinter group argued we should dominate the Reapers rather than destroy them. Oh. It fractured our order of battle. Later, we discovered the Separatists were indoctrinated. I always suspected as much. And now we're facing the same problem. Our studies of past ages led us to believe that time is cyclical. Many patterns repeat. Like the Reaper attacks. And beyond. The same peaks of evolution, the same valleys of dissolution. The same conflicts are expressed in every cycle, but in a different manner. The repetition is too prevalent to be merely chance. We assume the Reapers were responsible for the pattern. Unknown. Its presence is inferred rather than observed. The only certainty is its intention. Galactic Annihilation. You now stand at that precipice. There's still hope for this cycle. We need to know what the Catalyst is. Trillions of lives are at risk. Trillions of lives are always at risk. But if the Reapers have arrived to end your cycle, this discussion is too late. We can break this cycle. We found your plans for the Crucible. We're building it right now. The Crucible is not a Prothean design. It is the work of countless galactic cycles stretching back millions of years. Each cycle adds to it. Each improves upon it. Thus far, none have successfully defeated the Reapers with it. Then we'll be the first. Tell us what the Catalyst is. Listen to the human. She can be trusted. I detect you are one of us. You are Prothean. The last. I am the final hope to avenge our people. Your mission was known to me. Do you believe this present cycle can deliver retribution? They have earned the right to try. Tell us what we need to know. Very well. If you have followed the plans for the Crucible, I will interface with your systems and assist with the Catalyst too. Indoctrinated presence detected. Activating security protocol. You. You killed the scientists. What do you want? Your attention. Someone would like to talk with you. Shepard. How did you find this place? The archives. Or did your Prothean expert miss that one? Show yourself. I promise I won't miss. Stick to your talents, Dr. Dasani. You've helped uncover the key to subjugating the Reapers. Or destroying them. Damn it, Shepard! Destroying the Reapers gains us nothing. How about peace? They're just trying to control us. Think about it. If they wanted all organic life destroyed, they could do it. There would be nothing left. What the hell are you talking about? I know them, Shepard. I know how they think. I think you've gotten a little too close to the enemy. No. I'm saying they've got it right. Why kill when you can control? You've been spending too much time with the enemy. They're dragging you over to their side, their way of thinking. No, I just... see things differently. If you truly care about humanity, you'll stop fighting me. You'll join me. Don't ever question my intentions. I've sacrificed more for humanity than you'll ever know. And don't assume you know me. 
My methods for dealing with the Reapers are simply more refined than yours. You have forgotten everything you stood for. Cerberus was supposed to be humanity's sword, not a dagger in our back. Poetic, but as usual, you miss the point. The world is more gray than you care to admit. With the Prothean data in this beacon, I can end this conflict once and for all. You're either with me or against me. There's nothing gray about that. No, I suppose there isn't. Leng, the commander has something I need. Please relieve her of it. And then bring me the data. Understood. Oh, okay, let's hope he gets singularity. Damn it. Oh. What the hell did he just use on me? Maybe see. Stasis? Nope. I've been hit! Cover me while I recharge! Copy! Oh, man, just can Throw my stuff. Commander, the gun. Get to cover. Yeah, I see that gunship. I've got this. Do you? I don't know what he's doing over there. I'm gonna abuse it. Whoa. Your friend Kirihi died like a cow. Ah, I need to it. recharge. Cover me. Oh, <laughs> oh you pathetic dude. The gunship's taking a position. I don't think I'm doing anything to him. Ah, I missed again. There's a. Got him. Finally oh, a real boy. Shadow <coughs> strike. Ah, oh, damn you. God damn, bastard. You've had your fun now, Shepard. It's a pity. The good ones never last. What? I'm needing to recharge now. There's only one way this ends. Fist fights. Oh. Oh, she's spamming that one shot sniper. Target the support. I'm back. So the missile launcher. thanks you for all your hard work. So snob. Shotgun. <coughs> Looks like a cannon. Hmm. on my back. Maybe it's the sniper rifle. Anyone on this frequency? This is Lieutenant Curin. My squad is trapped. 
This is Shepard. Give us your location. I repeat, is anyone on this frequency? We read you. Give me your lo- The lieutenant's down. Our whole zone is collapsing. What happened to Shepard? Did they make it to the temple? I saw them. We... I've got a reaper inbound. <laughs> Please, is anybody there? I... Oh, goddess. No! Background in the temple. I saw someone. A cutscene. Okay. They don't show it again. Last time I played this, it was super glitched. Heavily modded and super glitched. Commander Shepard, are you there? Commander? Counselor? The mission... Contact with Thessia has been cut off. When will the Crucible be ready to use? Counselor, I... I wish the news was better. We didn't get the information. Why not? Cerberus was there. We were... we were defeated. We don't know how to finish the Crucible. I... don't know what to say. What was the situation on Thessia? Deteriorating fast. The Reapers are there in strength. Then I should be going. Plans... must be put in motion. Continuity of... Civilization has to be considered. I never imagined this day would come. None of us did. Um... I warned you. Sorry. I warned all of you. Multiple times. Asari forces are in full retreat. It is no longer safe for us to remain in this system. Get us out of here. Shepard. I... Nobody could have predicted Cerberus would reach Thessia before us. Yeah, because it makes zero sense. It's my job to be prepared, no matter what. And now Thessia's lost, as is the data on the Catalyst. I'm sick of Cerberus beating us to the punch. Let's kick them in the balls first for a change. I'm with James. Anyone know where they're hiding? Anyone? Um... Well, there is something. Let's hear it, trainer. I was able to track Kai Leng's shuttle through the relay and extrapolate his destination. But the signal disappeared in the Yera system. Naturally. It's not just gone, though. The signal is being actively blocked. How? I'm not sure. But something is interfering with all signal activity in that region of space. Commander, the Yara system is home to Sanctuary and little else. Sanctuary is a supposed safe haven for war rape. You think it's worth checking out, Trainer? Yes, Mom. I do. If Specialist Trainer hadn't examined the data so astutely, the interference would have been undetectable. Wait. She said, yes, Mom, instead of yes, ma'am. I'm not the only one who heard. Right. Right. Nice work, trainer. You've given us a shot. Now let's make sure we don't waste it. I was stationed on Horizon in the Lyra system, and you were the only Cerberus presence while I was there. It's a slim lead. Let's hope it's the right one. I don't care how slim the leads are at this point. We've come too far to let Cerberus stop us. I want that Prothean data. I want the Catalyst. No excuses. Dismissed. Commander, Admiral Anderson is available on VidCom. No, no, I don't want to talk. She did call me mom. I heard it. I'm a sugar mother. Call my dad now. So 
with the fall of Tessio. Tessio has fallen. Yeah. Not after we took down that Reaper on Rannoch. I don't know. Yeah. But there's no way we could have stopped every Reaper on Tessia. The Asari should have jumped in earlier. It's not the Asari's fault. They always were against us in the council. Okay, let's talk to the crew. <laughs> Alright, here's another one. Uh, dates back to the Rachni Wars. So, a Krogan and a Salarian have landed on a Rachni world for a top secret mission. That is unlikely. Salarians rarely took part in raids on Rachni occupied worlds directly. <sighs> Missing the point. So, the two guys are climbing up a hill going through this nasty green fog. And as they get near the top, they come out of the fog, and the Salarian sees thousands of Rachni. He looks over at the Krogan and says, Oh, well, that makes me nervous! The Krogan says, You think that's scary? When this is over, I have to go back down through that fog by myself! The implication being that the Salarian soldier would be dead. Yes. Thank you for killing the 2,000-year-old joke. That joke plays to racial stereotypes on both sides. The Krogan appears brutish and insensitive, while the Salarian appears weak. Stereotypes such as exemplified here led to the development and use of the genophage. Well, well, yeah. It's also one of the only jokes you'll hear both Salarians and Krogan telling. Comedy isn't really about being nice. Sometimes it's a way to air out the ugly things people think. So Thessia, huh? I guess the Asari are wishing they had fewer dancers and more commandos right about now. Oof. Too soon? Oof. <laughs> In case you hadn't noticed, we just lost a few million people. This isn't the time. You see this? Tip tree. Little colony out in the ass end of nowhere. My dad lives there. So does my sister. Reapers rolled in about two weeks ago. So you can assume that I'm generally aware there's a war on Commander. So why the jokes? Because Edie says that according to your armor's metabolic scans, you're under more stress now than during the Skillian Blitz. Like, more than a coup's, where Thresher Maws ate the rest of your squad. And the last time I had a briefing with Anderson, he told me to take care of you. The guy leading the resistance on Earth is worried about you, and I'm supposed to help. I appreciate the thought, Joker, but I'm fine. The hell you are. You're like half robot at this point. No offense, Edie. And it's my fault. When the Collectors blew up the first Normandy, you died because I wouldn't leave. Because you had to come back for me. I couldn't leave the best pilot in the fleet behind, could I? Yeah, well, I guess that would have looked bad on your report. Come on. We got work to do. Oh, what a choker he is, though. Good jokes. Commander. Edie. Shepard, I have a question about human behavior. This isn't the best time, Edie. Perhaps humor? A penguin is driving through the Arizona desert. I'm not in the mood. A lively rendition of La Marseillaise? No. Very well. I will maintain a respectful silence until you indicate otherwise. Hello, Shepard. Okay. Okay. What else do we have? Oh, they are. Jimbo will have some say. No. Lord Tana. Dr. Chakwas sent word that she'd like to speak with you down in the med bay. Oh yeah, I may have had a quest that I finished with her. Shuttle bay, no one important. Engineering, no one important. Chakwas first. I'm running a weird way in there. Yeah. You always pull through, Commander. We've received the supplies from Tactus. Everything good? Indeed. We've acquired some very useful equipment. As such, I've been able to enhance the effectiveness of our Medigel delivery systems. Nice. I've also collated information that Liara may find of interest. Check with Glyph. I always pull through right after the mission where I didn't pull through. Oh, Ronnie. Okay, Caden, okay, you're in here this time. He ain't the only person who walks around. Wait, no, oh, woman. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's see if I can find him. Nope. Not poker this time. Probably messing with 
Liara. Oh. That's not a thing I guess. Dr. Tassoni has gone to speak with the Prothean. No. No. Well done. Okay, I've got skulls. Voice Caden. Maybe he's doing calibrations. Uh, that would be interesting. First time I've been in here. Nope. Into. Okay, let's go downstairs. Engineering. Speak with the brophy. Shall really do this playthrough. There we go. Commander, we were just talking to Liara. She's a strong one. I'd say her world's just been completely rocked. Completely? Adams and I were just remembering Novaria and the terrible way her mother died. Liara seemed so together afterward. It couldn't have been easy. <clears throat> For weeks, she told me stories about her mother. Yeah, me too. I have a feeling she'll be okay. Yeah. Hope so. And don't worry about Kai Lang. Now that we've seen his dirty moves, next time, he's getting his ass kicked. Count on it. That's the spirit. Can't wait to get back out there. Okay. Let's see what Leora is up to. That's not true! We earned our place in the galaxy! Stop denying reality, Asari. Your people took the knowledge of my people from the Beacon. I have a name. It's Liara to Sony, and I'd appreciate you, you- <laughs> Hey, settle down. My home was just destroyed, and all he can do is gloat. Given what's happened today, I think you owe Liara an apology, Javik. Apologize for the truth? For not doing more. You're a Prothean. You were supposed to have all the answers. How could you not stop this from happening? We believed you. Long ago, we saw the potential in your people. Even then, it was obvious. The wisdom, the patience. You were the best hope for this cycle. So you were guided when necessary. Well, it didn't work. You're still alive, aren't you? Your world may have fallen. But as long as even one Asari is left standing, the fight isn't over. I guess that goes for Protheans, too. Despair is the enemy's greatest weapon. Do not let them wield it. Liara to Sony. Did you mean any of that? She believes it. So she will keep fighting. Isn't that what matters most, Commander? Carry on. <laughs> Lies. It was good to see another of my kind. Even if he was just a ghost. One more Prothean fights the Reapers. If there is to be victory in this war, it will be for all cycles. The living will avenge the dead. And do not concern yourself with Thessia's fate, Commander. The loss of a planet is insignificant next to the loss of the galaxy. I suffered many defeats in the last war, Commander. Let this loss be the fuel that powers your rage. It seems you believed Protheans built the mass relays. The Reapers are cunning in their deception, allowing life to flourish, century upon century, letting us believe ourselves the masters of the cosmos. Then the truth becomes known. There are monsters in the dark spaces, and we are their prey. I am with my own thoughts. Yeah, and then dark as usual. So dark. Okay. Now we'll just switch outfits and probably end it. Switch weapons, stuff like that. Stuff like that. And always invite her currently. Okay. We're done. Peace out. I want exactly 30 minutes. Exactly. Oof.